should never guess I don't slack, don't lose, learn your lesson yet When I get to choose what I do, I'm like a weapon I'm as sharp as many, but got hard I'm ready to change scars to envy To win large and plenty I like to play fast, never change back So hey guys, welcome back to my channel for tutorials So guys, today I'll teach you how to create 3D camera motion tracking animation with using Blender See guys, that's my really simple and smooth camera tracking animation Right? Okay, so guys, I show you my render preview. So click on here and go to our back and play. Yes. So guys, I teach you how to create this type of effect. Right? It's really simple and best tutorial for beginners. So stop and go to our here file and I create new. So new check. So firstly, guys, select all and press delete key. So go to on here VFX and motion tracking check. And guys, you can delete this joint area check and off. So firstly, click on here, open. Guys, import your clip. And you can download this clip, link in description. So next one, I change render setting. And guys, Sam128. And go to one here, film and transparent check. So lastly, go to one here, color management. And view, I'll like standard, yes. Right? Okay, so now next one. Go to one here, set screen frame check. And prefetch check. Yeah, so guys, go to on here, play. Guys, my video is rotation, location, and same time of scaling, animation, right? So stop and go to back. So guys, see that's my motion model. I like this one. Location, rotation, scale, and normalize check. And go to on here, tracking, extra setting. So guys, action, I like 0 0.9. Yeah, that's it. So guys, now I take dotted point so detect feature check and increase this point so guys see that's my threshold like a 0 0.01 and distance I like 80 yes that's it so guys click on here it's my track marker check yeah and again click on here last so detect feature check and one more time track marker backward check Okay, all is good. And next one, guys, next step, go to our mid. So, guys, mid like a, this one, 290 frame. And again, detect feature. So, guys, track marker, check. I take tracking on mid. Yeah, again, 290 frame. And detect feature. So, guys, track backward, check. Guys, take little bit time for tracking on back side. Okay, so guys, my track marker is finished. And guys, this tab is complete. So guys, next one, you can hide this red dotted. So hide, so Alt D, yeah. And go to one here, solve. And guys, see that's my keyframe B. I take randomly like a 190 and all refine check, yes. And solve camera motion check. Click on here, solve camera motion check. So solve camera motion. See, that's my error. Solve error is 2.01 pixels, not correct. Guys, your error should be less than 0.5. So I decrease this error. So go to on here, clean up and filter track check. And guys, see that's my threshold. So decrease like a 2, yeah, and delete your selected points. So press delete key and delete check. And again, solve camera motion check. Yeah, so guys, this time solve error is 0 0.39 pixels best. Guys, now you can create more decrease. So this time clean track check. And see guys, that's my error. So I take like a one, okay, 0 0.6. Yeah, 0 0.6 is good. And again, delete and delete tracker check. And one more time, solve camera motion check. Yes, perfect. So guys, this time solve error is 0 0.22 pixels is best for me. So guys, you can create more decrease is depending on your work. So you can go to on here one more time. Filter track and filter track show this time I like one 
ओके सो वन पॉइंट फाइव या वन पॉइंट फाइव इज परफेक्ट एंड डिलीट योर एक्स्ट्रा डॉटेड पॉइंट बिकॉज आई क्रिएट ओनली हेयर ट्रैकिंग दिस वन स्पेसिंग सो आई सॉल्व कैमरा मोशन चेक Yes. So guys, my solve error is same. Zero point two three pixels best. So now, guys, my tracking is finished. And click on here. Set as a background check and set up tracking scene check. See guys, that's my tracking scene. Guys, you can connect this plane and cube on this one here. So guys, this time select any three points. So like this, this one. and this one is good so flow check okay so now guys i change scaling so guys select only two points two like this and set scale check so distance i like four enter yeah right see guys that's my flow so go to our mid and go to our here see guys that's my set origin check yes and guys now play yeah but guys one problem it's not connect to flow properly so go to one back and again guys select only three points another three points so like this yeah and flow check and again select one more time like this this one this one and connect to this one and flow check yeah this one is perfect right i select this tracker points and this position is perfect for me and guys now again go to on layout and press zero yes so guys select this one cube and auto shade smooth check and i like one position and play yes so guys my tracking is perfect right so now guys next one you can change position and also size so go to on edit mode so edit mode check and also guys wireframe check here and guys go to on back here so apply on this side corner to corner connect here right it's really simple yes great okay so guys now select this one and little bit back yes select this point yeah that's my simple terrace shape okay so guys go to on object mode connect to here and play yes see guys that's my beautiful tracking right it's really simple and stop so guys this time go to on here select this edge this one and little bit front so press guys for extrude press e and g and go to down yeah and again press e and g and go to on here yes right see guys that's my simple shape and right click auto shade smooth check yes So guys, go to on here, and also guys, go to on camera and increase opacity. Opacity one check. So play, yes. Okay, so guys, my tracking work is perfect, right? And now guys, you can apply 3D models. So guys, I already download some 3D models. So guys, you can delete this cube and go to on here file. So guys, import. So I have some three D objects. See, guys, that's my three D object. So import. So scale size change like this, and also rotate your three D model. So rotate like this, and go to a mid. Yes, perfect. And guys, now I apply this time as the R image. So guys, you can apply any as the R image as a your footage. So this is the R image is perfect for my composition and import and click on here. Yes, and guys, now go to on here and little bit rotate your model. 
Yes, perfect. And increase size. Yes, great. See guys, that's my beautiful composition. And guys, now you can change this one collection. Go to here, this lighting. Yes. Okay. So guys, I show you my one frame render. So render, render image check. Okay. So guys, this time, guys, my render is beautiful, but uh, uh, shadow and composition is not perfect. So close. Guys, you can delete this light. Delete your light and delete your this one collection. And guys, select this one. And I apply sunlight. Sunlight check. And go to an up. So guys, little bit back. And rotate your sunlight. Like this. Yeah. And guys, go to an up. And increase intensity like a 4. So go to a camera. Yes. See guys, that's my beautiful shadow. Right? And strength are like 5. Guys, 5 check. Yes, much better. See guys, that's my beautiful shadow. And play. Yes, great. Okay, so guys, my composition is perfect. And lighting and shadow is perfect. So next one, guys, you can apply more objects. So guys, I have some objects. So go to on here. And go to on file. Append. And desktop. Guys, you can download all assets from my website free. So go to a collection. Yes, see guys, that's my card. So change scale size. So I apply on here. This side and rotate. Yes, perfect. And apply on this side. Okay, also guys, you can change scale size. Scale size little bit change and go to down. Yes, perfect. And now next one guys, I create rotation. So rotate. Okay, so select this one and rotate your card. Yeah, little bit more and up. Yes, and guys check. So go to a last. So rotation 1440 and check. So guys, now next one, select your keys and right click. So I like liner, liner check. So play, yes. Good, see guys, that's my beautiful composition. And now guys, duplicate this card. So press Ctrl C and V. I apply on here, this side, yes. And press zero, yeah. And click on here. So guys, little bit here and down. Okay, this position is perfect. Okay, little bit down. Yes, great. Right, see guys, that's my composition. And next one, guys, you can apply more objects. So guys, go to on here. Guys, you can create more smoothness shadow. So go to on here, sun, and increase sun angle. So guys, increase sun angle like a, a seven is perfect. Yes, seven is good. This is my shadow. And I like five, yes. Okay, so guys, all is good. And now next one, I apply more objects. So go to on here, append, and this is my collection and object. Select this object and append. Yeah, it's my simple 3D toys. So, guys, scale size change like this and press zero and go to on here. So, guys, I apply one by one. So, press one and up this one. And lastly, select this 3D model up, yeah. And little bit change position. Yes, great. And press three. So only go to on here, randomly position change. Yes, perfect. See guys, that's my simple toy and press zero and click on here yes great right it's my simple composition right okay so guys all is good and now guys play yes 
Okay, so guys, that's it. My final work is finished. My final work is perfect and perfect composition and perfect render. And guys, for render, go to on here. FPS, I like 30 FPS because my video FPS is 30. And output, go to on here, create new folder and take any file name like a one and accept check. Yes. And one more time, play. Yes. Right. So guys, that's it. My final work is finished and go to and render and render an animation check okay so guys that's it my final work is finished so guys if you like my video please share and please subscribe my youtube channel thank you